Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, I think the only showers we'll have this weekend will be showers of leaves. It'll be pretty gusty both Saturday and Sunday. Leaves coming off the trees. It means a more yard work, but there'll be a dry wind. So once again, not much in the way of precipitation. Let me show you what I'm tracking, which includes a very dry month. I mean, we've yet to see any significant rain. It's been very mild up until a couple of days ago uh, with the temperatures uh, running about. Uh, let me check here. Two and a half inches below average as far as rainfall. Uh, maybe a couple of sprinkles Saturday night. Even that may be pushing it. Uh, feels more like November. Temperatures running below average. Next chance of any potential, perhaps significant rain later in the work week. And we'll show you that in the uh, seven day future cast. Skies are clear in Providence right now. Temperatures continue to tumble down to 36. Smithfield below freezing at 30. Taunton close by at 33. New Bedford 39. Some locations getting down into the upper. 20s during the overnight hours and early tomorrow morning. So the furnace kicking on. Skies are clear. Rain and snow showers in upstate New York will stay away. So we'll keep clear conditions throughout the overnight. And we'll get some sunshine in here for tomorrow morning as well. Let me show you on Futurecast. Starting off at 11 o'clock this evening, you don't see much on the map as far as you know, solid cloud cover or even precipitation. 8 o'clock in the morning, chilled sunshine. The kind of morning where you step outside, you see your breath. It's pretty cold. Frost on the, uh, on the car windshield, that kind of a deal. Uh, by tomorrow afternoon at around 2 o'clock, just some fair weather clouds mixing with the sunshine. It'll be breezy and dry. Temperatures in the 50s, uh, partly cloudy tomorrow evening, and then extra clouds during the overnight hours. Small chance right there, a little sprinkle passing through, but basically a dry and cold night coming up to, well, perhaps not as cold tomorrow night, but cool tomorrow night under partly cloudy skies. Certainly very cold tonight, upper 20s to low 30s with clear skies. Tomorrow morning near the freezing mark, then rising through the lower and middle 40s with sunshine. Southwest winds started to pick up, so it'll be pretty breezy by tomorrow afternoon. Temperature at 55, though the wind should make it feel cool. A little bit of a wind chill, but overall a nice day. It'll be dry and cool. Seven day future cast shows after a sprinkle Saturday night. Back to sunshine, breezy, a little milder by Sunday afternoon in the upper 50s. Looking good for Monday and Tuesday. Clouds increasing Wednesday. Uh, kind of a difficult forecast as far as trying to figure out the timing of some potential rain showers in the Thursday, Friday time frame. Of course, the Halloween on Thursday going with a chance of showers, but you know, the timing is tough. It could be Thursday morning and not so much Thursday night. So stay tuned. tuned. We certainly feel confident that it will be milder by the end of next week. Uh, Red Sox, of course, in St. Louis on Saturday night, and the, uh, the weather is looking fine for this. Uh, generally clear skies and dry temperatures in the upper 40s. First pitch at 8 o'clock in the evening. Patriots kick off at 1 o'clock in Foxborough on Sunday. Nice day, sunshine, breezy and dry with temperatures in the upper 50s. So if you're an early riser tomorrow morning, you'll start the day off at around 32 degrees. I know you guys like to jog around 6 in the morning, so that should be nice. Oh, I start around 5. five. Okay. So, <laughs> hey, thanks. Not at all. <laughs>